Hi, Cancer, getting ready to do your reading. Let's see what is showing up for you. Cancer, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. What are the messages for Cancer? You may be dealing with someone named Jimmy or the James. Also, something around Jackson. That could be a city. This could be someone's last name. So you're manifesting something. It says, tell the universe exactly what you want and a hidden, well, the pearl says, uncovering lost wisdom, hidden knowledge. You're going to, you're manifesting something hidden here. What, what is that for cancer? Feeling way down, may four of wands, three of coins. Some of you may be moving or thinking about moving. Or maybe you don't even think about moving, but four of wands, maybe you have family you don't know about. I don't know why that's coming through, but... You may find a group of people who are very helpful, like a hidden, yeah, hidden help. I'm getting, manifest what you want. If you want help, if you want money, something like that, and, you know, tell the universe. It could come in a way that you don't even expect it to happen. Okay, what else is going on for Cancer? Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Unexpected, yeah, unexpected. The Phoenix Rising. You may be receiving help in a way that you weren't expect. uh, Keep repeating the word realization be careful proceed with caution though be aware yes people are spying on you or watching you you're being protected you're being watched over but try to get out of something take a sideways approach something is ending there's closure hmm let me go to this deck because it feels like there's someone around you who is envious of you or is watching you Yep, shark. So you got it in both decks, Cancer. So there's someone or people, I don't know how many people, who are around you, shark. Sharks in the water. It says, be careful, proceed with caution and survival and power. You may not have help around you. You may need help. You may need to ask the universe to help you out, like, like ask specifically. Um, you may have people who are either trying to take you down or not on your side or not helpful, and you need help from a situ like from maybe people you don't even know or something. Um, you may find out that someone, yeah, again, doesn't want you to succeed or be successful. So, okay, so again, someone's like trying to tear you down. You may be coming back around though, because unexpectedly rising from the ashes, becoming the phoenix rising, doing well, doing better, more money, finances coming in. Changes are happening for you, Cancer, but people are watching you. People don't want you to be successful or succeed. So this could be in your job, your uh, family, this could be frenemies, awareness, awareness of someone spying on you, someone's doing their research. Something about like getting out of something at the right time. Like it's almost like better to like if someone like says you owe them a hundred dollars to pay them the hundred dollars because if they do research, they're going to find out, oh my gosh, you owe them like a thousand. Or like they could take more from you if they had, knew you had money. Like if you act like, I don't know, how to, like I'm kind of getting like this, something like that. Like just try to get out of it the easiest you can without, even if, because there's sharks in the water. It feels like creditors, people wanting money, people who don't want to see you do well. Moon and the Ace of Swords. What is going on here? Who is spying on cancer? I'm sorry this is like starting off as such a negative message. On one hand, I see you doing well. Like you may unexpectedly do much better than you were expecting. Like, why do I keep saying that word? I've said it like six times. And again, I think this pearl, this what you're going to uncover, may not be good. I keep seeing an air sign possibly. Maybe a negative air sign. But again, air sign, king of swords... Can be someone who like you don't know, but they're cold. Who is spying on Cancer? Who is this? The realization that someone's actually a shark and they're spying on you. What is this energy here? Holding on to money, four of cups, or holding two of coins, four of coins, two of cups, the ten of cups, the ace of coins, high priestess. I'm seeing you get, yeah, somebody around you is manifesting, someone from your past, someone who's not doing as well as you, someone is spying on you. Okay, so this is a message that, you know, obviously this probably hasn't happened yet. So you need to be aware that you're going to have some good news come in. Something's going to go in your way. Something's going to be lucky. I don't know if you want to broadcast it to everyone because you have people who want to take you down. And I know that sounds really mean, but it is. You could be in a new relationship soon, Cancer. You could have an offer here. Maybe maybe from Pisces or Leo, or maybe that's who's working against you. 
but it's kind of like if they see you doing well it's like they're going to try to block you or stop you it says again you're lost it's like you have guardian angels try to get out of something as easiest or as best as you can without like drawing a lot of attention to yourself otherwise it's kind of like you're going to like end up paying more wow that's not good message but it's a warning you know it is what it is what else does cancer need to know at this time what else does cancer need to know at this time it could be a fire sign that's wondering about you it could be somebody out of the blue cancer sending you messages Someone's been thinking about you at their job while they've been, they've been wondering about you, wondering about your job or wondering about you when they're working, um, missing you maybe. They think you're the nine of coins. Yeah. Okay, I think this is a good person though. This I think is the okay person. It was the king of swords and that could, could be a man, a woman, could be any sign. They could be someone you don't even know at this point. Somebody wants to see how you're doing. They've been thinking about you. They miss you. They do like you, though, a lot. Wheel of Fortune, Hangman, wondering what happened to you. Tired of you not reaching out or talking to them? They have an offer, an opportunity for you. It could be a relationship. It could be work, too, okay? Because two cups can come up in a work relationship, too. This is someone who respects you and likes you, but I'm going to read it from as love. But Hierophant can be work as well, but all right. Manifesting. You're manifesting the devil, though. See, that's not good energy here. See, but the King of Swords is under the deck. Justice, the King of Swords, death, a new beginning, something is over. Justice, someone's pissed off. I think they're pissed off with you, like they thought something was going to happen, and it didn't, and now they're angry. Someone, Sagittarius or Pisces, Scorpio, Libra, something new. Somebody wanted something from you and then you didn't give it to them and now they're mad at you. So again, I can't tell if it's the King of Wands, if that's the same person as the King of Swords. However, I do see that something good is coming in for you. I think a King of Wands, someone's going to come in and give you some sort of offer opportunity that's going to be really good. However, the path you're taking right now could be a Taurus or a Capricorn. It could be an Earth sign who's trying to hold you back, who wants to keep you all to themselves, doesn't want to share you, doesn't want you to get away from them. They may try to make you feel guilty. Yeah, this person feels left out in the cold and they've been wondering about you, wondering like where you went, why things ended, wanting to come back together with you. They may just want to sleep with you, but... Um, Trying to hold on to you energetically. Cancer, you have someone in your energy who is very spiteful, who's bad. And it looks like someone that you were just like, oh, I don't like this person. Maybe, you know, for many, there could be tons of reasons, could be different, you know, could be an ex. I don't know who it is. But they don't want you to move on to something better, but yet you have an opportunity of something better. You need to be strategic and smart because there's something it's like you have to get out of. And you need to keep things to yourself and not be posting everything online and telling everybody your plans because I'm thinking you may not even know who this, like you know the person, you don't know that they feel this way. Show me the nine of wands. They feel like it's a three of like, they feel like you cheated on them. They feel like you aren't honest with them. Person may be a little wacko, so be careful. Someone kind of wants revenge, but I'm getting. This is kind of weird for a cancer reading. You know what I mean? Like this tower, not moving forward tower. Ace of swords. Someone wants you back. Somebody wants to keep you down or keep you with them or keep you hidden or keep you from moving on. Occasionally I see this with a family member, like even a parent, like a mom even. So I have seen that as like a codependent type of energy. Like you can't go, you can't move on, you can't be happy, you got to stay here and take care of me. But 
whatever this is that's coming up like this is a really bad thing is what i'm getting you're gonna find okay because it's like on one hand it's like you want to manifest some something new and you could get it out of nowhere you could receive help you could be receiving something with the six of coins that we came out earlier at the same time you're going to bring out someone's negative side who doesn't want to let you go but you got to get out of the situation wow that's kind of deep right but it is what it is you got to face it shark survival and power so you feel like you're being pushed under water water like you can't breathe like you got to get out of something it's suffocating let me go to a different deck for you let me pull from a couple other um if this is resonating and let me pull from a couple other decks too to see what the hell is going on for you so this is obviously for the masculine or the feminine doesn't matter who's viewing you want to move on what's going on for cancer what is this message that's coming through for cancer feels like someone's not giving you what you are owed or what you deserve someone may be mad at you and wondering about you too what you're doing like i already said I'm just kind of getting someone could t be telling you one thing but do the opposite they really don't want a relationship but they don't want you to move on or they don't want you to be in a relationship something like that again yes yeah, so i'm seeing different people here i'm seeing a lot of masculine energy this could be a same-sex partnership again this could be work i get eight of coins under here doesn't really matter that the message is coming through so just be aware that someone is definitely watching you and doesn't want to see you happy with somebody else what does cancer need to know what does cancer need to know what does cancer need to know yin which is the feminine energy time for a nap so if you're the feminine energy viewing you need to like four swords that just take a break because there's a change in the wind and you're between worlds right now you're going to have a new life you'll be happy with milk and honey so again don't take any opportunities that you don't want don't jump at anything because the right one's coming along you don't want to like say yes to the wrong one and like just breathe four swords yeah so i mean you got things here where it's like take a break take a nap take a rest don't move forward too quickly um things are changing good things are coming in serendipity luck right timing being flexible with, and receiving messages soulmates okay see this one is ex explaining it differently very like this one's much nicer right much mellow energy so but this is a phoenix rising part that came out originally cancer this is like you are rising you are going to a new phase you are going to something better it is going to happen you are going to receive messages so don't um again don't take the first thing that comes along if it's not the right person or thing and just know that someone does not have your back and they don't want you to be happy they want, don't want you to move on in some way so um sorry i wasn't super positive this week um but you actually have good messages for the future anything else cancer needs to know i don't get like this is really a love reading at this moment so i'm not going to pull anything from the love oracles what else does cancer need to know at this time intention oh no it says initiation the crossing number 54 you also have first breath beginner's mind that's at the four swords starting from scratch starting over and the wall there's obstacles right now 56 authentic self many masks so you may not know who to trust Tidy house, clarity and organization. You need more clarity, that's number one. You need to maybe organize right now, clean house, get things ready, but again, like, that was the four swords. Maybe it's like not time to date someone new or do anything to, like, just manifest what you want, put it out there and just hang on because you could have some things thrown at you that you weren't expecting. People that you may not trust or, you know, maybe it's a good time to just like i said take a nap stay home not go out um just wait for the right opportunity 
get out of something. Okay, hope that made sense, Cancer. Hope that made sense to you. I'm going to leave it there, you guys. Have a great weekend.